Uh, my name is Paul Hayes, I'm the CEO and Director of Anton Art Centre and for this production I'm also the producer. It came across my desk about six years ago. Uh, Jackie McCarrick is a Dundalk writer. I read it and I absolutely fell in love with it. Um, and then it started a process of trying to get it produced. Uh, Quintessence were then the theatre company in residence at Anton and I thought it would make a, uh, a great show for them. When I read Belfast Girls, and I read plays all the time, I've been a script reader for Druid, The Abbey, for my own company, uh, I was blown away uh, by the sheer epic nature of it. Um, as someone who was schooled in Irish theatre when it was more kind of text-based than it is today, uh, all the way back to Singh and O'Casey through Friel and Murphy, um, Belfast Girls for me felt like that. It felt like a really, really important piece of epic Irish theatre that has a place in the canon uh, going forward. Uh, and I hadn't read anything of that kind of nature in a very, very long time. Um, then to hear that it was by a Dundalk writer, uh, it made perfect sense that Anton would give it its Irish premiere. What makes me excited about Belfast Girls is it's quite a large scale show for a regional art centre to produce. There isn't particularly a history of regional art centres producing large scale work. Um, we're more generally receiving houses, but on, at Anton we've been producing shows every year for the last nine years since we founded it, but not at this scale. Um, and I think I realised that if we didn't do it, this show may never have got an Irish premiere and having received so many premieres worldwide, I just I couldn't really uh, stomach that. Um, and then to take it up to, to the Lyric Theatre in Belfast with the support of uh, my colleagues in the Northeast Net Network, which is Drihid Art Centre and Solstice, coming together to, to finally put this show together. I think that's, that's, that's really exciting. So next year, 2024, is Anton Art Centre's uh, 10 year anniversary. Um, I couldn't think of a better show to do on our 10 year anniversary than Belfast Girls.